I would go back to Phil. What's up, brother? Come here in and one week in 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 and out. Prophesying the downfall. We talked to you before, Asia. Don't like that offensive picture. With offense, can't even believe that's rude, bro. That's offensive. Right. We come in the name of Yahweh, Shem Yahweh Shah, and prophesy downfall for me, which is our pleasure. You know? So it's about time. That's all we can say in our mouth, man. It's about time. Hey, it is a pleasure to come out here and tell you everybody this raggedy shit's gonna be destroyed. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. There's only so much of those I can take, man, when it's come out of prophesying. Or waking up the elect, or uh, you know, or the lost sheep, or even telling the two thirds and other nations who they are, man. The most high is only gonna put up with so much, man. word nurture that's where you get the word well come from like nature also that's where you get the word nutrients you know what i'm saying when you unnurtured you ain't got them nutrients and the vitamins and nutrients a lot of y'all malnourished out here y'all spiritually and physically malnourished out here especially spiritually they ain't got none of them proper nutrients you know what i'm saying none of that good water we're offering it to them right yep this, this is that that oasis right this is that oasis in the middle of the desert right here they wandered out there up in the desert hot as hell thirsty and then they walk by the oasis they die in a thirst they don't even stop to get a drink they just keep going it looks too clean and then they went to the other oasis that was a mirage you know what I mean? for when unrighteous men thought to oppress the holy nation they being shut up in their houses, the prisons of darkness and federal bonds of, of a long night, lay there in exile from eternal promise. For while they supposed to lie hid in their secret sins, they were scattered under a dark veil of forgiveness, being horribly astonished and controlled with strange apparitions, ghosts, demons. That's you, man. You put them in the garage with, with, the, with the cars, with the Ferraris and all that. It's like that. Yeah, he's over the dog, dude. Ranch one. That's how you do it. <laughs> oh, we can't put him in the garage with the dog, so you know what Job said. Oh, he can't sit with the dog. Can't sit with the dog. So what they do, you see the internet, they do a Google search. Bestiality. Oh, yeah, you put him under the dog, yeah. They're yep. not going to do what you think. Right, right, right. See, that might. And the dog don't know no better. You know what I'm saying? The dog will probably end up liking it. You know what I mean? What do you call these niggas on the streets? Call them dogs, man. They call each other. What's up, dog? What's up, dog? Even the girls call each other bitches. Like, all they do say, "What's up, dog?" Oh, that's my, that's my, yeah, that's my dog. Family of beasts. They do call each other dogs. That's crazy. Dogs bitches. Dogs and bitches. Yeah, but they like, "What's up? What's up, bitch? That's my bitch, dog." For neither might this corner. That held them, keep them from fear. The voices, the water soaring down, sound about them. The sad visions appeared unto them with heavy consequences. No power of the fire might give them light, 
either feel the bright flames or the stars and throw the light that horrible night. Like that horrible, that horrible night. Only there appeared unto them a fire kindled of itself, very dreadful. What's up? That's not Jesus. Oh, well, she seen that. They still, they still surprised when they see that poster. It's damn 2017, and you, they still ain't seen that yet. You know what I mean? Right. That's why. That's why you gotta keep coming out here too, because you think you done did it. Everybody, there's still people that ain't heard the word yet. And people still thinking that that's the Lord right there. They still think Cesare Borgia is the Lord. They still think that. <laughs> that's crazy, man. That's, that's crazy. <laughs> I see some people, I see some people post some stuff today, like one of my old friends. I done told him of the truth to he's like kind of retarded though. I wanna say retarded. But he uh I've been told this guy the truth years and years ago. Told him the Lord's name, told him the Lord was a so-called black man, told him his name was Yahawashai. And I see him post a picture today, show the Lord is a so-called black man, but said his name was Yah Yahushua. Like, bro, I've been told you this years and years ago. Now you say, yo, who should we? What the hell you get? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, don't believe in what someone else tells you. You know what I mean? Like your friends and family, they're, they're, never, they're, they're not going to believe the truth when you tell it to them. Maybe the last one, they to believe it. Like the scriptures say, a prophet is not received in his own country. And the scriptures also say that your enemies be those of your own household. Like you go, if you learn this truth, don't be going to try to teach your mom. Yeah, that's in Luke, right? This is all going to the point I was trying to make it in this chapter 17 anyway. They look at you like you crazy. What is y'all? People are Israelites. Israelite. You are Israelite. So she dad's an Israelite. Because she was born in Israelite. What's an Israel nationality? Israelites. It's the, guy, it's the Lord's chosen people. Right. So how you know how you wanna know how I know you're an Israelite? Because through your spirit, I'm looking at your eyes. You know, we we have that spirit of Israel. You know, the eyes is the window to the soul. Yep. Right? Right? Now when you see a wicked ass nigga step, you can't just look at him and see, oh that's that nigga that's no good. You, you can feel the evil spirit. Right, right. Right. You know I mean? So yep. through, through the scriptures, we're coming out here to tell to wake up, you know, the lost sheep. And being lost is by you not knowing you were an Israelite. But now, you're not lost no more. Now it's up to you whether you accept it or not. You know, which is kind of right, right back to that. So this worthy to be laughed The minute the Lord got jokes. They're set up to deceive the children of Israel, you know? Because they, 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 they talk about the mother food. The mother food. Purple. Oh, he ran into the, the purple See, ninjas? Yeah. yeah. They're set up to do what they're doing. they telling you that when the Bible says that destruction is coming, martial law, you know, concentration camps, thermonuclear missiles, they don't teach you no more. They they gonna teach you you gotta become successful in America. They say we gotta build up our communities. When the Lord didn't say, you know what the Lord said about the communities? 
He said, fuck the community. He's going to destroy the community. And it's a community-based Israelite. The Lord ain't dealing with no community activities. The, the Lord going to destroy all. Everything you see is all going to be destroyed. There's going to be no prosperity in America. There's going to be no building businesses in America. America's meant to be destroyed. Okay, so the thing you're supposed to be building right now is your faith, not a business. I mean, if you got, you can make money. You can go make some little dollars or whatever. Go make some money. But the main focus and priority is learning this truth, teaching this truth, not trying to become part of this world. And World War III is right around the corner. You be watching the news, right? You see how North Korea in the news every day uh, launching missiles. They just launched a missile. Was it yesterday? Two days ago. They said they're gonna turn the White House into a pile of ashes. You know what I'm saying? For real? Oh, yeah. You ain't see that? Yeah. It's in the news every day. They're gonna kick the White House out. Well, that's what they said. Well, some, uh, ultimately, Russia gonna come up against America. Cause you got the two, the two baddest boys on the block is America and Russia. And sooner or later, them, them, they got a fight. You know what I mean? To find out who's the, the top guy. Yeah, and Trump think think he's a badass, right? So Trump, so he, he the Most High put the the pride in Trump. So so Trump is puffed up with all that pride. That pride, he's all proud. His money, his money got it. Yeah, he's a puppet though. We know he's a puppet. Cause really, you got the elites behind the curtains. You know what I'm saying? Like the Wizard of Oz, <laughs> the man behind the curtain controlling everything. Yeah, that's in the scriptures. That's in the scriptures. That's what he's just saying, because Trump's really a puppet of the Illuminati, the so-called Illuminati. Because really, we're the real Illuminati is us. Because the word Illuminati comes from the word illuminate, which means to be filled with light. And the only light you're going to see, the scriptures calls us the children of light. You're being illuminated. Yeah, you're being illuminated. Right. So we the real Illuminati. They ain't not even allowed to use that. Remember what I told you, it's up to you when you walk away from here, whether you accept it or not. Like, like it says in Ezekiel 9, it says, go to the streets of Jerusalem. And let me just get it. Okay, go and read that. Okay, that's good. That's good. This is me. Ezekiel 9. You got to go with the Spirit. Right. Yeah, it, even yeah, too. the book of Daniel. It's all white. It's all white. Yeah. You can see people right here. Everything is great. You can read in the book of Daniel too, it says the most high. God himself got well woolly hair. Ezekiel 94. And how it said unto him, go through the midst of the city, through the midst of Jerusalem. But you know, I, got, I got the Bible, I got the Quran. What the You gotta leave that Quran alone. There ain't no truth in that Quran. And the Bible's our book. against the order of the Most High. Ooh, but now you got churches pushing back and stuff to say we gotta accept them. And if like Jesus never taught hatred, that's what I'm trying to say. I can assure you the Lord was not a fan. Don't be surprised when they pull up and motherfucker will keep doing the running ass over. That could happen, bro. 
to the angels. So like when the angel, the angel you think that the Lord sent the angels, the angel ain't gonna show no pity just because you're an old woman. The old wicked ass woman, the angel's gonna kill you. Oh, strength. oh the old mean? woman. Oh, strength. That That's the mark of the beast, the microchip. Soon, you're not gonna be able to buy or sell anything without a microchip. Because right now they already got the credit cards with the chip in it. You go to the store, you be like, do it, take the chip. They're like, yeah, it takes the chip. You stick your chip in, but soon they're going to put it uh, either in your hand and they got brain microchips. they pushing it soon. Everybody's going to have a microchip implant in their brain. And they calling that the evolution of the human species. You know what I'm saying? And that, well, you gonna, you already seen it, right? You probably watched the news or whatever. I heard about, I heard about the kids. They're going to be pushing a microchip. You ain't going to buy shit without that. You ain't going to be able to get on a Coda bus. You ain't going to be able to get no uh, EBT. EBT is going to be all on the microchip. So I'm saying all your uh, medical information is going to be on the microchip. And so these people out here, the majority of people, they're going to take the chip because they don't want to starve to death. You know what I'm saying? Because they got no faith in the Lord. Yeah, hey. Take that chip. You know what I'm saying? The most high will destroy you because. It's like pretty much puts not that chip because it's like it, it's like a uh, it's like a uh, like a brand from uh, what's the brown child like a brand from yeah it's a brand they brand their cheeks they brand their cap right they brand everything they want to do possession all the possession they brand they brand their cheeks they brand their cap right they brand everything they want to do possession all Check this out. This is Jeremiah 51 and 19. The portion of Jacob is not like them, for he is the former of all things, and Israel is the rod of his inheritance. Remember he was reading in Ezekiel 9 how go through the midst of Jerusalem and, and smite. And the name mentioned, and the mentioned what, uh, man, old man, old woman, whatever the fuck ever. Anybody, all the wicked. 
The Lord don't, you know what I mean, say just because you are old later, a little child, you got little wicked, evil little children. That's right. You know what I mean? Right. The Lord of hosts is his name. Thou, thou art my battle axe and weapons of war. So, thou is peace. Yeah, because soon the Lord going to give us power, bro. Ain't no one else going to receive power but these people. That's it. And like that scripture also said that Israel is the rod of the Lord's inheritance. So what is the Lord, what's the inheritance of the Lord? It's to be the rulers of the planet Earth. Gods! Yeah, this, you know, the Bible says we are God. Gods! Let me get that for you. Listen, bro. Gods! Don't you want to be a God? It's or you want to wake up every morning a God. sick, hungry and shit. You know what I mean? Hungry, yeah. starving. Oh, wait a minute. Wake up every morning oppressed. You know, having to go to work. Right, for your enemies, submitting some of your income to your enemies, man. They, before, before you even receive a check, okay? Before you even receive your check, they take your money out. You ain't got no power to do nothing against that. Huh? Where am I from? Columbus? What you You just weren't in a visa. Was he going back here? No, everybody can't be safe. Everybody can't be safe. I'm not stand out. I'm confused. I was gonna read this. No right, 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 right. Yeah. 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 Okay, let me show you. Let me show you. Let me show you something. Don't you know the Lord scattered Israel among all nations? So that's where you got a lot of Israel that don't look like Israelites. Because he scattered them among those other nations. So if you go but just put visuals. If you and your family went to China, right? And your family start to mix with those Chinese, y'all gonna continue to look the way you look now? Okay, so that's why you got some of Israel that don't even look like Israelites. Like Bruce Lee. Right. Is Bruce Lee an Israelite? Do you know you who Bruce Lee is? Right. That's an Israelite. I, I'm, I'm new. Okay. Right. How'd you find out you're an Israelite? Those guys in the purple. Oh, I actually had. I was recorded and I got to put some Facebook accounts. How long ago was that? Right here. Facebook, boy, you learn everything. Everything. Lisa, like Facebook and fire. I saw a sister by the name of Facebook and a brother by the name of Michael Bishop. Them devils. Them devils. I know exactly what they're doing. Them niggas ain't devils. Devils. Well, okay. Now listen, just because somebody come in the name of Israel don't mean they know the Lord. Yeah, they a lot of them. A lot of them have a, a lot of them have hidden agendas behind the scenes. The scribes and Pharisees, so they 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 yeah, I know exactly who they are. Now the truth is, we gonna bring, give you the truth for hundred percent, not some of the truth. You know. Let me ask you a question. You know who Eminem is, right? Slim Shady. Is he an Israelite? No He's an Israelite. You can't. You get. You gotta look at his spirit. And he's like the most respected rapper out of all of them. All the Judites always give me mad, mad love, respect. Like, man, he's like the best. I ain't never listen to this shit. I don't listen to that <laughs> bullshit either. The best one, Bar he, He's an Israelite, though. We know that. Oh, oh, yeah, Bob, you know Bob Marley? Is Bob Marley an Israelite? Yeah, I would just assume that he was. Because his father was a... Uh, black was uh, black skin. But his father was a white man. Okay, what about Nelson Mandela? Nelson Mandela is? He was, a, he was an African. From, he was from South Africa. Nelson Mandela. Now let me show you Nelson Mandela. All right. Yeah, but going back to Bob Marley, you know his father was a white man, right? Well, actually, he, oh, that's he right. was an so, English. So you go back to your father. But, but even though he was an Israelite, though his father was an Englishman. Because that's yeah. what it goes to show you, though, that, that you true. can't judge people by appearance. Right. Yeah. 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 See, I'm um, over here. <laughs> Yeah, the scriptures do say the judge not by appearance. No, not judge not according to appearance. I got another one too. What you got? I'll go ahead. Yeah. John 7 and 24. Judge not according to the appearance, but judge righteous judgment. Yeah, judge righteous judgment. What did it say again? Judge not according to the appearance, judge not according to the appearance. Judge righteous judgment. Yeah, because you got scriptures in the Old Testament that's going to leprosy laws about how Israelites was off in the wilderness catching leprosy. And, it, and there was laws on how you dealt with it. That's nothing, man. Right, okay. That's not an Israelite. Right, right. So everybody with black skin ain't a thing. Right, right. 
It's like you go to uh, Australia, you see them around with rich people. A lot of them are jakes though, but those, their people are self, with those big noses that look like they just crawled out of a sewer. Those, that's, that's the Jap thing. That's the tribe of Jap, Japites. On yeah, you got a Real lot of different pirates. people teach different stuff, so you gotta watch out. Yeah, yeah, cause the scriptures tell you they always associate Jaffa with an island. You know what I mean? Jaffa is known for being in the islands. Israel, the land of Israel, Ishmael, the Arabs. Yeah, that's an Arab. Like, like the. Uh, it's like the Pacific Islanders, like the uh, Australian Aborigines. Do you guys um, think you have, like, okay, because the Noah, the Hill, the Hill, the Hill, the Hill, the Hill, the Hill, the 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 Hill, the the Hill, the the no, 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 they're not even, no. Man, at the end of the day, everybody gonna come from Adam, right? But it, the mystery is this, though. The mystery is that Israel was scattered among all the nations. See, like I got a scripture there. Uh, yeah, that's a good one. Uh, I got another one to back up the last scripture he read. First Samuel 6 and 7. But Yahweh, you know, the Lord, what, they teach you the Lord's name? The most high's name is Yahweh. And the one they call Jesus, his name is Yahweh Shah. Okay. That's good. Uh, so every time you see the word Lord in all capital letters in the Old Testament, that's the most high's name in Hebrew. Verse Samuel uh, 16 and 7. But Yahweh said unto Samuel, Look not on his countenance or on the height of his stature, because I have refused him. For Yahweh seeth not as man seeth. For man looketh on the outward appearance, but Yahweh looketh on the heart. See what I'm saying? Because man, we look at somebody, man don't see as the Lord sees. He definitely can't be carnal. What did the scripture say? A carnal mind is a death, but to be spiritual is a peace. You know what I'm saying? So we at peace. It hears a lot. Like, I try to not, like, when I love on to Facebook, I try not to get caught up in the, the drama. everybody's saying. That's that division of the Lord brought, because the Lord said he came to bring division. So you're going to have all kind of people teaching all kind of different so stuff. You guys think about, um, like, modern day parents. Like, what's that say that there's no Messiah, that's the whole book, that's the Messiah. They're going off, yeah. So they're Antichrist. Right. They don't believe in the scriptures saying, whoever denied the Son denied the Father. Who denied the Son? 